Jess Davis with the Ulster County Regional Chamber of Commerce and I want to welcome you to another episode of Jess Delicious. Today we are in downtown Kingston on a Beale Street at the Forsyth B&B. Before heading to the B&B, we decided to stop off to the downtown Kingston Farmers Market on the historic Roundout Waterfront. You can find Marla and Forsyth B&B Eats each Sunday at the market from 10 to 2. I am downtown at the Forsyth B&B and I am really excited to introduce you to the owner, Tamara Ellen. Good Hi. morning, Tamara. Good morning. Thank so, you so much for having us here this morning. What a beautiful property. Thank you so much. It's great having you. So this is a very traditional carrot cake with walnuts, um, lots, I use lots of spices and um, light, very light cream cheese frosting. The flavor is amazing. Thank you. I can taste all the layers yeah, of spice. Yeah, a little bit of coconut and we put a little cardamom in ours. Today at the market we also had an upside down cake that was all different stone fruit with a cornmeal cake. So um, I'm a really rustic baker. I really enjoy old fashioned baked goods. Guess what? There are walnuts throughout this piece of cake and carrots. So I'm totally <laughs> saying this is a healthy breakfast. There you go. Well, I learned to bake uh, and to cook because I had a single mother and if there was something that I wanted, I had to make it. She was busy. She was a great cook um not a great baker i actually thought cake always came out of a box you know i'm so happy in the morning when i wake up to come upstairs and bake and make breakfast for my guests it's really it's a joy it's always been a joy in my life it must fill the house with the most incredible stuff. oh yeah i'm always worried it'll wake people up but i don't think that's a bad way to wake up right <laughs> I want to talk about the catering, the, oh, the, yeah. uh, the space you have yeah, where people can have absolutely. little events. So I think a lot of people don't even realize that our barn is here. But, um, and we have done every kind of event. We just did a Sweet 16. We've done some, we did a wedding for 24 people, um, birthday parties, graduations, baby showers, rehearsal dinners. <laughs> You know, fresh fruit, it's uh, cantaloupe and watermelon and strawberries. And we make a little drizzle with honey, lemon juice, and just a little bit of chili oil. It won't taste hot, but it'll bring a little warmth. So that's a fresh corn pudding. Um, it has also zucchini and peppers, uh, fresh herbs, uh, ricotta cheese, a little cornmeal. Um, and cheddar. So it's sort of a cross between, it's sort of a corn casserole. Uh, and then I like to serve it with a nice fresh salad. We belong to a CSA, so the greens are so beautiful right now. And we serve bacon sometimes. We are vegetarian a lot, um, but it, corn and bacon are a beautiful pair. They're a match made in heaven. So, uh, and then roasted potatoes. I'm excited to take a bite. Mmm. Like that? Some of my favorite things here. Yeah. The zucchini with the sweet corn and then the cheese. It's rich. Wow. Kingston is a very special place. I remember driving through the very first time and saying, why do people not know about this? Why didn't I really know? And I absolutely fell in love with it. Um, and it, Kingston has been really good to us. We love it here. That is a chocolate chip shortbread cookie. I make a lot of shortbread because I love the texture. And um, it has a little tiny bit of, lip, uh, of orange zest. This is so good. I've never had anything like this. Yeah, it's soft but a little crisp on the outside. Because you almost think it's going to taste like a blondie. But it doesn't. Right. It doesn't have it that fudgy. in your mouth. Yeah, yeah. So good. Thank you. And the other one is a, um, a lemon sugar cookie, which my favorite recipe for sugar cookies. 
and uh, you might not know this about me but I love cookies <laughs> it just feels less guilty right it's just a little cookie you just gotta have it and you know you can have a, a run of each kind on the platter there you go. it's chewy just a little bit of lemon mm -hmm. just the right amount yeah. I think I'm gonna have to find a reason to come stay overnight here at the Forsyth B&B, or maybe one of you will host a small party and invite me, because everything here at the Forsyth B&B is made with love by Tamara, and it is just delicious.